Namaste fam, Wolfcore here, and welcome back to Sekiro. Oh my. What Namaste window did I leave open? Wolfcore here. Oh no. Welcome back ah. to Sekiro. Ah. I don't want to listen to myself talk. <clears throat> there we go. Muted. Fabulous. Alright. We're back in Sekiro. All of our settings are correct, except for the fact that they're not. One moment. <sighs> there we go. Now all of our settings are correct. Okay, so we are continuing our quest in New Game Plus to get past Genchiro. And to get, get past Genchiro, I want to unlock an ability called Shadow Rush because I believe that it is good for fighting him. Now, where are we at with unlocking Shadow Rush, you might be asking. Well... Let's come over to the skill tree. Shadow Rush requires six points to unlock. We have two and a half. And we're just going to continue to explore the available areas before you fight Genshiro. Uh, just to get all the stuff, just to explore. And hopefully we'll get enough experience from doing that to unlock Shadow Rush. If not, it's going to come down to farming. But I think we still have uh, at least one more area to explore. And to do that, we need to go to the... Abandoned dungeon. Bottomless hole. Oh yes. There's a bottomless hole in our future. And we will be jumping into that bottomless hole. And it's going to be exciting. Alright. Here we are. I believe this is the last option of things we have to do. Uh... How do I grapple? I totally forgot how to grapple. Okay. <laughs> I haven't played Sekiro in quite a few days, so... Uh, that was a little scary for a brief moment. Alright. We've got a My Boo Balloon. And what is this? Oh, hello. A zombie. Well, we know how to deal with zombies around here. Give them the old R1. Hello. Hello. What do you drop? Pacifying agent. Fancy. I don't believe there's anything down there. I have explored down there in the past. So we are going to hop down into this here hole. Hey, is that Maria? How are you, my dear? Thank you for being here. How's your day going? More pacifying agent. And an idol. Thrilling. Let's get that little bit of health back. Why not? Ah. Here we are. I do believe there are some cannon fuckers in this area. And there's one. Oh! That was close. <laughs> Shit. Ah, oh, crap. Fucking me up, lady. Snake eyes. Let's go in a cage, just tired. I was tired too. I tried to take a nap and I ended up putting on a podcast. And oh shit. I didn't think she'd come over here. And then the podcast was super interesting, so I didn't end up taking a nap. Fascinating story, I know. Um I don't like the way that this is going, so we're just gonna rest. Oh, by the way, happy 420. Blaze it. Alright, uh, let's just try all that again. Uh, I didn't like the way that was going. Oil. Ooh. That. Ah, that. Ah, ah. Ow! Okay, what podcast? I was watching 
Uh, today's Joe Rogan podcast, he had on uh, Russell Brand. Three and a half hours, and I listened to the whole thing. Those two guys sure are interesting. I'll give them that. Hello, snake eyes. <laughs> you fall powerless before my axe. Ow! Uh oh. Almost. Almost powerless. Oh, I fucking had her. Ow. Fuck. Stop doing that. Woo. There it is. All right. Cool, cool. I thought so. I thought so. Hey, Jack! Idiot plays! I haven't seen you in a while, my friend. I've been not watching streams and will continue not to until I get secure as to not spoil anything for myself. Well, thank you for stopping by, my friend. It is wonderful to hear from you. And uh, hopefully get Sekiro soon so we can start hanging out again. Good to hear from you, though, brother. I listen to a podcast about The Shining. They cut the movie into chunks and talk. Ooh, that sounds quite interesting. Oh, dear. I'm about to be poisoned. You! You caused all the trouble. And now you pay. And now you pay. Howdy, bitches! <laughs> What's up, Steph? How you doing, brother? <laughs> Wonderful. Wonderful greeting there. I approve. What have we got back here? A monkey! Monkey boos! And that's just the boss room. I found the nestlings in Dark Souls 3. What are the nestlings? Tell me more about these nestlings that you found. Seems to be an item over there I missed. Bummer. A bundle Jesus statue. Ow. Birds on top of Firelink Shrine. Oh yes, of course, the nestlings. I didn't know that's what they were called. Yeah, they're super useful. They do all sorts of neat little things for you. Kind of. Oh my god! Grapple onto the right fucking thing, you dummy. There we go. There we go. This better be worth it. Scrap magnetite. It wasn't. Oh, I need to get my Dark Souls 1 on again. I don't want to let that playthrough fade into the abyss. That would be the second time I didn't complete a playthrough of Dark Souls 1. I'll try and do some Dark Souls during the week. This coming week. Kind of sad because the podcast ended. It was the first podcast I listened to. Oh. I love a good podcast. I didn't even know what podcasts were for the longest time. It was just like a name of a thing that I heard. 
And then I found the Joe Rogan podcast, and I was like, oh, I get it. This is rad. It's like radio, but better. I kind of want to do a podcast with me and my friends, but it would just be us sitting around calling each other bitches and fags, and I don't know how well that would be received. I'm not taking it off the table, but yeah, I don't know. Hello? Rest. I wonder if there are any other horror podcasts. I don't know. If I hear of one, I'll tell you. That is an interesting niche, no doubt. Ah! 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 You scared me, you son of a bitch. How dare you. Ah! Fuck off. Ooh, we have to fight a headless soon. Fun stuff. Being staggered! Jesus! What the hell was that? It was a mess. That's what it was. Did you watch the new Vati video? I did not yet. I forgot. I don't know why that hasn't popped up on my YouTube feed yet. I would think that it would, but YouTube does annoying, stupid things like that often. So let's go ahead and fight this headless, shall we? we use some of this. We're going to use some of this. And we're gonna suck on this bad boy. Hey! Ow! Damn, son. Ow! Ow! Oh my god! Fuck, he's scary. So aggressive. <laughs> Fucking ah! Forgot. I can't dodge. Oh my god! Oh, the terror! Fuck! I hate headless! Alright. Need some of this. Need to do that. Need to rebuff. Scoobity boo. Ah! 
Oh, come on, man. Why the fuck did the terror build up so fast? Ah, oh, fucking headless. I almost had him. Feels bad, man. Hey, what's up, Cross Prophet? How are you, brother? <sighs> A headless boy. A headless boy, indeed. The bastard. We'll get him this time, fam. I got the platinum. Nice. I am nowhere near. But I'm working on it. Piece by piece. Damn cocks. Alright. Time to rebuff. Grinding out skills was horrible. Yeah, dude, it's getting really hard. I'm trying to get Shadow Rush right now, and it's taking for fucking ever. And it's just one skill. And I gotta get a bunch more after this. But it is what it is. that build up so much terror. No! Fuck! Come on, hit him! was that? Ugh. Did you see that bullshit? Just instant fucking terror. Ugh. Fucking hate headless. Alright, alright. Here we go. Just gotta kill him one more time. Divine Confet. Fuck you! Get up, Sekiro! Oh my god! Why is that terror build up so bad? This is ridiculous. Ow! Leave me alone, you whore. I mean, I understand that I'm the one attacking you, but still. realized I fucking died and lost experience. That didn't even occur to me before. Ugh, feels bad, man. Probably should have just skipped him. It's not like I needed to kill him for anything. But whatever. The double itchy manji. It's a good skill. My favorite place to grind is at Fountainhead Palace. Go to the Vermilion, Vermilion Bridge, jump down, and kill the nobles. Then continue on backstabbing everything else. After 11 enemies idle back. Interesting. Yeah, I made a, a decent farm in the palace as well. I'm not sure if we're talking about the same one. I don't know if you saw that video I posted, but... Yeah, it's a fun place to farm. I like it. Ah! That was a mistake. 
Ichimanji. The new game plus three, they give 1600 XP. Oh, baby. Which idol in the palace? Uh, it's the flower viewing stage, I believe. What's max level in this game? Uh, well, there isn't technically levels. There's just unlocking the whole skill tree. But I don't know how many XP points that takes. I guess you could kind of discern a level from that. Alright, let's move on from here. Right after I get this item. Whee. Hello. Hey. Hey, you. <laughs> if you know the 127. Order, Damn. Would you slay one who opposes it? One who opposes the Buddha? Correct. <laughs> The one of whom I speak hides in an abandoned temple up ahead. I'll see you when you return, Maria. Village in a no hurry. Fog. But he can fool the village here. Okay, okay, okay. I get you, old man. Hello, cock. Ooh. What's that? Oh, damn it. Bollocks. Fuck! Come on! Wolf, go! Oh, why are you so bad at this game? Come on, just give me something to grapple to. There we go. Fuck. Uh, I don't care. Moving on. I'm out of here. Can't go that way. But what's over there? It's gotta be something. Oh. Light coin purse. And a cock! That's experience. That's what we're here for. More cocks. Stinky little shinobi. Stay up. Ow. I think we have another mini boss in this zone. Let's do him. That will be fun. Bork, bork. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Gonna try and do the speedrunner method. <gasps> oh, I almost got it. do this shit so consistently. <sighs> Fuck up some dark wraiths on the high wall. Nice. You tell those dark wraiths. 
they're fucking with the wrong guy. Not my boy. No, sir. Damn it. I would really love to do this. What? Maybe they patched it. I don't know. I give up. Oh, the glutton, yes. Yes, we're gonna go fight the glutton. It will be fucking. Ow! You fucking dog! Oh, baby, ceramic shards most powerful item in the game. Oh! Yeah. That was fun. I liked that. Hello, love. Come on, dude, make the jump. Ah! I don't think I've ever used ceramic shards. How are they the most powerful? Or are you being sarcastic? No, dude. You didn't see my ceramic shard farming video? The best ceramic shard at farm in Sekiro? A yeah, little known fact. If you use a ceramic shard on a boss within five seconds of the encounter starting, it'll open up a death blow window. Pretty incredible. Sarcastic. Me? I'm never sarcastic. How silly. <laughs> Why? I don't know. Ask Miyazaki. He's the one who designed the game like that. Fuck off. Visible fucking bork borks. Yeah, the only reason people don't know that they're the most overpowered item in the game is because nobody ever uses them. Think about it. In all seriousness, uh, I made an April Fool's Day video uh, that came out slightly late um, stating that the ceramic shard was the most powerful item in the game and I had found the best spot to farm it and that <laughs> I edited the footage so that it kind of looked like if you hit a boss with a ceramic shard, you'll slam it against the wall and do a death blow. <laughs> it was super dumb, but I had fun making it. Welcome back, Maria. Alright, 
little bit low on healing items, but... Shit. Oh! Still got him. Nice. Come on, monkeys. Bring it on. Oh my god, you hit hard. Oh! Woo! Oh! I don't know your move set at all, dude. No! Why? No! Oh my god. Oh! Oh! I'm fucking stuck on a tree! have my moments. Well, I'm gonna go now. Bye, kitty. Bye, wolf. Bye, crows. Thank you for chilling, bro. See you next time. Ugh. So little XP. Take out the Mist Nobel. Shall we? Mist is gone. We can continue.
Allez, yo. I wonder if I could land on that shinobi guy down there. No! Oh! oh! That's a shame. I even got the red indicator, but I missed the window. Ah! He's scary. He's still looking at me. Don't you look at me. Isn't the snake here? Um, I don't think you run into the snake here. If I'm not mistaken. Which I very well could be. terrible XP here. If we do end up having to farm out this skill, this might be better than the Prada Estate. Fuck off. It's son of a bitch! bit of a pickle. Maybe I should just go reset. Alright. Got some healing items. We're back in business. I think the snake is in a cave? Oh, I need to look for that. It's entirely possible that I missed it on my first playthrough. Entirely possible. <laughs> Damn it. No! You son of a bitch! How did you know I was there? Fuck this guy. Oh my god. I should have just snuck. I'm gonna make this work. I am determined. I've done it before. Catacombs are fucking bullshit. Yeah, they're they're they have their challenges. What about them is giving you trouble? Oh my god! And he didn't deagro again. This is getting ridiculous. Fuck this guy. He must have great senses. LOL. He does. Jeez. All right. One more try.
Really? Really? You're just standing there waiting for me to come back. Sure as shit, no, they didn't hot fix it because of my video. Why the hell is this guy so attentive? I refuse to give up. I refuse to fight this son. You know what? Fuck it. I'm just gonna fight him. Just fight the bastard. I can take him. Ah! Than a little axe work can't handle. 1500 XP. That's pretty good, but he's too much of a pain in the ass. Care to purchase an offering? No. LOL, like I can Where you hear, see, body. feel, and sense You'll you, LOL. Memorial you really can. <laughs> you really can. Fancy. Where you find way? <laughs> Hush. Don't mock me, old man. Dogs. Bring it! Bring it! Alright, we good. What happens if you try to kill one of these vendors, I wonder? Nothing, you can't. Now we know. Dawn was so scary, if you moved your controller, they would spot you. Oh, that's interesting. Never tried that one. Until Dawn. Catchy name. I'm back for round two. The monsters would insta kill you? That's harsh. That sounds pretty scary, actually. In case you're wondering what the best place to farm ceramic shards is, right here. God, how many of you are there? I'm about to 
is enough, is enough, is enough. You done? Alright. Basket, basket. No. Calm down. You are you an honorable person? Maybe. Yes. Oh, thank goodness you are an honorable person. Is there something you want to ask? Look, sorry, but uh, and permadeath if you die. Oh, Jesus. Answer with this basket on my head. Until dawn sounds intense. Oh, gotta go, huh? I'll be here, hiding in this basket. Mm. Can't kill him, noted. How does one get out? Like this. to hit me with a board, bitch? I don't think so. Hydro, Wolf McGore, hola! How are you, brother? Thank you for coming by. Lay stream. How are you doing today? but it's not terrible. But do you remember my YouTube name? Of course I do, Chill. Monsieur Chill Production. I told you I would remember it. I would remember it as soon as I saw it. <laughs> not so great, unfortunately. I'm sorry, dude. What's going on? Unless you don't want to talk about it. In which case, that's all right. But if you do, I'm here. Look at all those ceramic shards. Hot damn. down, bitch. Had memorial for my stepfather today. Dude, I'm sorry. That's awful. He died of uh, lymphoma, 44. It was pretty devastating, especially for my mom and my 16-year-old half-brother, his son. Dude, that really sucks. I'm so sorry. Uh, internet hug. It's not much what I have to offer. 
Fuck lymphoma. Ah! Let's go over my feet. Stop it! really told anybody. I don't desire any kind of sympathy, but I thought here would be a good place to let it out. Dude, you are in the right place. Just wish there was more I could do. If there's anything I can do, just let me know. Oh, these grabby boys are so annoying. Ah! Enough! Finally reached the fucking catacombs bonfire. Congratulations, I'm proud of you. Ow! Ugh. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Okay, you know what, buddy? Fuck you. not got some wolf gore Sekiro though. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. I'm a stealth kill this bitch. Damn it! 
You son of a bitch! Ugh. Why is that so hard for me to dodge? level annoying. No, 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 no. <laughs> LOL. Not easy, it's hard, is what I meant, LMAO. For some reason, I read I ready isn't easy, lol. Yeah. I understood your meaning. Closer to Shadow Rush. Is Orin in this area? Yes. We are very close to Orin of the Water. I'm a little concerned about fighting her right now because I don't want to die and lose experience. So we'll see what happens. over here that I need to pop inside. Oh, it's a cock. <laughs> Feast of Ash. I'll take it. Ah! Ah! Alright, so there's one more little corner over there we need to explore. But I'm thinking we should rest first. How do I get up there? Have too many pellets. How do we get that? Oh, I 
can make it. Nice. Don't side with Owl. Um, I know there's four endings, so I'm going to end up doing them all. But I don't know if we're going to side with him this playthrough. If it's any consolation, I did not side with him for my original playthrough. Because I was following my heart. Alright. Rested up. See what's over here. I don't want to side with Owl, but that Ashina fight looks really fucking hard in that meadow. It is. It is. Kind of glad I got it out of, out of the way for my first playthrough. I don't feel super compelled to have to do it again. Although I did invent a cheese method for it, so there's that. Ballots! More zombie fishmen to kill, but that's okay. We can use the experience. There's cheese tactics? Yeah. Or, no, that wasn't a question. That was a statement. Yeah, from what I understand, it is the evil ending. I don't know if I'd call it an evil ending, but it's definitely an ending. That's for sure. this time. Lame! Oh, that's a bellboy. That's two bellboys. I don't want to fight them. Legitimately, at least. I want to stab them in the back. I always have trouble pulling off cheese, except for Butterfly, I cheesed the shit out of her. I didn't actually cheese Butterfly, I actually just practiced the fight. Uh, what's the cheese for Lady Butterfly? More bellboys, damn.
Sneaky, sneaky. Sneaky shinobi. Oh, 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 oh. It's my opening. Yeah! I just repeatedly flip attack her rhythmically over and over. I lost rhythm. I dodge away. Then back and keep it going. Interesting. A flip method. So by flip, do you mean like you jump on her head? That's a lot of loot. Count that as zone completed. Let's move on towards Le Bosses. Orin and Zamunk. Oh, fuck off. Actually, I can just use my idol. fight Orin. If she kills me once, we're just going to reset because I don't want to risk legit dying and losing experience. Oh, I love that guitar thing. Now, nah, the sword attack holding L1 and R1, the attack should land right before her attack gets off. That's the rhythm. If the attack lands, you've lost the rhythm. Side away, then back, and it should land just before her every time again. Oh, what an interesting method. I never would have thought of that. Thank <laughs> you. 
God, she's scary. It's my new waifu. Who's Lord Sakuza? I don't recognize that name. I'm not sure, but I haven't memorized all the names yet. Kill her in the dick. <laughs> I did it for you. That damage, though, I know, right? Welcome back, crows. Happy to have you. We just killed Orin of the Water. And, oh, that was the last of my healing gourds. Thank goodness. We finished that off. Remember, use a bite down right before you die. Ah, that's a good idea. I have the bite down, I've never used it. Oh, the guy she's crying for. I don't know who that is. Vati needs to uh, enlighten us. I mean, she's like an undead, so I presume it's somebody from the long dead from the past. But with the immortality being a factor in this game, it's really difficult to say. Oh, I see a bellboy. Necessitate again without needing a death blow. I did watch a video on how to utilize it correctly, so I do understand the concept, but uh, I haven't actually used it. I'm not good enough. <laughs> ah, I'm stuck! What is happening? Holy shit! I know there's a way to get up in there down here. There it is. Divine confet. Ooh, red lumps, nice. Hello? Gulp, gulp. Hey, what are you doing? <sighs> it feels... Does it? I don't like that I can't kill NPCs. It bothers me. Right, I think we are up to the boss at this point. Except for this, what's this? How do I get out of here? I have to swim. I think I have to swim. Alright, I'm gonna try not to cheese this boss, but I'm not gonna risk perma dying because I need my experience. So we're gonna equip snap peas just as a last resort. If I die once and I have to resurrect, we'll use them.
Fucking learn to Makiri counter, Wolf. Never. That's all she wrote for sugar. Ow! Fuck! Oh god! Oh! Trying to do two things at once. Did not work out well. There's a limited use on those. Got it. <laughs> Good to know. <sighs> Nonetheless, we can still do this. Now. Ah, <laughs> jeez. No deaths here, thank you very much. Ravens are such pretty birds. Yeah, they really are. Hey, now we can swim. Crows are so smart. Yeah, they are. I believe you can only get there via the idol right before the ape. Attack power up. Good shit. And I think that is the extent, other than re-exploring all of the lakes, now that we can swim, I think that is the extent of the exploring that we can do before Genshiro. So we might just have to farm out a couple levels real quick so I can get my skill. 
Your attack power is 49? Holy shit. The lady tells you to make the monkey dance, but I don't know how, so I use the Great Father Prosthetic. Oh. Oh, the monkey dance. What you do is you use um, a puppeteer ninjutsu on the monkey, and it will distract the snake for you while you run into the room. Assuming we're talking about the same spot. Hey, Wolf, what's up, dude? Who is that? Your name is in dark blue. It's hard to read. Blue? Nose Gaza. Uh, is this somebody from YouTube? I don't recognize the name. But what's up, dude? Thank you for being here. How are you? As I know so far, there's only two applications for puppeteer ninjutsu. That one that I just talked about, and then the kite in the Maibu temple. Or the Sempu temple, whatever it's called. Ooh, look at that jump, he's like a dolphin. Now. Le stupid fish. All right, we only need a level and a half more, so why don't we just go farm that out? Probably in the Harada Estate is going to be the best be my guess. I don't know why I'm killing these fish, but I'm going to see it through now that I've started the fight. Use it on a normal enemy, you can make a big boy with a bell sling it at his comrades. It's hilarious. Ooh. That's rad. Okay, I need to try that at some point. Uh, do I have anything worth purchasing? Probably hey, not, but let's check. I do not. Until next time. Yes, yes. Let the farming montage begin. don't need the gold for anything. Probably not worth picking it up. I've acquired 113 heavy coin purses. Hot damn diggity. You are ballin'. I wish there was something you could dump your currency into in this game. Sen, at least. Because, like, I am totally stocked up on all the consumables I'm ever going to need. So it feels kind of pointless to get currency, which isn't great. I don't love that. But I do still feel the need to pick it up for some reason. How did you even kick sand? We're on wooden floors. 
attacker. Divine confetti collected all. I have over 200. Yeah, I have like 180. And I just, I don't think I'm ever going to need that much. I should just use Divine Confetti all the time. Have a dope purple or a pink flaming sword. That sounds kind of cool. Now. that or spirit emblems. I keep 950 to 999, 999 at all times. Yes, yeah, here. I'm already stocked on spirit emblems. Like, the point being that I was able to get fully stocked on everything in my first playthrough without very much effort. I mean, granted, I did make some farming videos, but still. Like, you would almost, almost want the items to be more expensive to the point where it feels like you want to keep collecting gold so you can at least keep purchasing the items to kind of keep your stocks up. But, I don't know. Not saying I don't love the game. I would just like it if there was something else to spend currency on. If you could convert it into something useful. Crystal Sage is down. Nicely done. Uh, there is a prosthetic that you can use. Your Sen haven't tried it yet, though. Yes, the Sen throw. I did try it. Um, it says it does lots of damage the more Sen you have, but I looked it up and it actually stopped scaling after like 500 Sen, or maybe it's 5,000 Sen. I don't recall, but even with... I had like 30,000 Sen when I tried it out. It does like pretty meh damage. Let's just put it on. See what it does. Like it doesn't even one shot these guys. I mean, it is fun, don't get me wrong. Throwing money. Maybe I'll just use this. I you know, I would really like this item a lot more if it didn't use spirit emblems. If you could just, like, keep throwing Sen. But it uses up your spirit emblems, and it's like, well, I need those for actual prosthetics that do something, like my axe. Max all crafting materials. I'll work on it. But at the same time, I was able to upgrade all my prosthetics in new game. <laughs> so, I don't know. I don't know. Boy, that run did not give as much experience as I would hope. I guess it was like a quarter of a bar, so we need to do this like five or six more times. I didn't know you could do that. It's only used gold, it would be good. If it only used gold, it would be good? Yeah. That would actually be fucking rad. Literally just kill bosses by throwing set at them. Love it. Ow. 
Now fucking stop. Text at the bottom of that pond is there. Did I miss out on that ending now? Text at the bottom of the pond, I'm not sure. Fucking dude, don't kick dirt at me, it's rude. Yeah, man, we expected something more spectacular, if you know what I mean. Yeah. Yeah, I know what you mean. At the very least, it would be cool if they removed the scaling cap. So if you were to farm up like a hundred thousand sen, it would hit like an absolute truck. That'd be rad. But then you're always at risk of losing your sen. I don't know. I don't know. They could have done something cooler with it, I think. Stop it! Better off in the Maibu village. They give less experience, but the density is so good. I think we're actually gonna head back there. These guys are kind of annoying to fight. I mean, they're not hard by any stretch of the mind, but the Maibu villagers just die. Like, so easy. Where are you in the story? Uh, we need to fight Genshiro. I am trying to save up XP so I can get a skill called Shadow Rush, which is apparently strong against him. Choosing whether or not to betray Kuro, just gotta get back to the castle and talk to Owl. Yep. That is a good point to be at. At one point, I had 50,000. Nice. Then you good. Don't talk to him yet. Collect all of the rice and eat it. Shadow Rush is meh. Uh, I don't expect Shadow Rush to be particularly good. Um, but I do believe that it is strong against Genshiro in particular because he can't block Shadow Rush for whatever reason. Yeah. Fuck! Fuck! Oh. This is a nice chunk of XP. 1500. That feels good. Treasure carp scale. Nice. Maybe be able to pick half of it up again. It doesn't connect. Didn't follow that. I figure I'm going to betray Owl and fight the dude in the meadow. I might as well go all the way, LOL. Yeah, do, do it. It's a fun fight. It's just really fucking hard. But you should try all the endings at least once, in my opinion. Let's 
see how consistent this is. If we can consistently de-aggro that shinobi. Ah! Oh. Alright. Well, he was de-aggroed, but that guy fucked it up. I think if we can consistently backstab him, it's going to be the fastest way to farm XP. Holy shit! That's what I get for trying to R1 spam. In New Game Plus 4, most enemies give 1,000 XP. Ugh, I'm jealous. I really wish I would have farmed out this skill in New Game when I had access to good farming routes. The problem is all the good farming routes are bottlenecked by Genshiro. I'm kind of stuck farming these scrubs. Have you done the Shura ending yet, Wolf? Uh, which one's the Shura ending? The only one I've done is where I fought the old man out in the field. And I, I broke the the line of the dragon's blood, whatever. I need to look up a video on all the different endings so I can understand what I'm doing. Oh, here we go, here we go, here we go. Yeah, bitch. Let's go get Genshiro! You have our will to help power you through the fight. I will, but we are only one skill point away from going to fight him. I really want to have Shadow Rush as a backup. I don't know how good it's going to be, I just know that I'm sick of wiping to that son of a bitch. Maybe? There's a sneaky way to do this, like... You spirit fall... No, nope, he aggros. That's pretty fast. Yeah, I think we're gonna do it like this, boys. And then we reset. The sure ending is where you obey the owl for a time. Ah. No, I have not done the sure ending yet. Cathedral of Dicks. <laughs> oh, shit. I almost had him. Wait, if I go invisible, can I just go stealth kill him? Because that would be fucking good. Fucking dickhead. Ugh. fairly quick. I'm okay with this method. You obtain both mortal blades on the Shura ending. Both mortal blades? What? Dope. Well, I definitely want to check that out. Oh my god, what? We can just backstab him? That's fucking good. I think we just found the best early game farming spot in the game, guys. And become an evil monster, lol. Oh, harsh. Don't judge. Oh, this is great. This is great. I'm glad our experimentation brought us here. This is good to know. Let's go ahead and... Uh, put 
put that thing on our bar. There we go. What you do with them thoughts is concerning. Yeah, I hear fire sounds. I'm scared. Oh, God. Only getting Sword Saint to do that guy is kicking my ass so bad. Ooh. Struggle, my friend. The struggle. I did some research on you, actually. Become a demigod known as Shura in Buddhism. Really? That's interesting. Now we know. Because knowledge is power. Ah, oh, son of a bitch. I ruined it. Fuck it, I'll just kill him with the axe. Best farming spot in the game. Oh, yeah. Not really. I don't know what that... Thox? That's interesting. Huh. I think I saw something about that in a lore video. Maybe. Entirely possible. Almost there, lads. Just a few more kills. The X was accidental. What? Thox isn't a word? Then what's a Twitch Thox? Pretty sure that's a thing. The Sparking Axe is really good at enemies with fire abnormality. Can't recover posture, so throw in oil, then hit them with the Sparking Axe, and mmm. I have not tried that yet, but I'm going to, since you've told me about it. I do love the Axe. It is my favorite prosthetic. It just gets the job done. Wait, how the shit am I supposed to get back into Ashina Castle? Um, with your feet. And your wit. And Dark Souls just fucking crashed. Ah, oh, dude. I'm sorry, that sucks. Dark Souls is pretty good about saving content, though, so... Probably didn't lose your save. Oh, you meant thought. Yeah, Maria got it. <laughs> What does thought stand for? Tiny ho? Something something? I don't know. I looked it up once, but I forgot. I mean, I understand the context in which it's used. But I don't know what it actually stands for. It's all grayed out and can't teleport the dungeons, you say. Yes, there should be one that you can teleport to. From there, you can spread out and recollect your idols. That hoe over there. Oh, thank you. That 
hoe over there. That's good. I'm gonna start using thought more. <laughs> Jinx. Pinch poke you on my coke. I've been had! Oh no, what happened? This poor guy is just in a waking nightmare. Let's see, we need 11,000 more, 1,500 to kill. So that's six, seven, maybe eight more kills. Almost there, fam, almost there. This Shadow Rush ability better be fucking good. Have you heard about orange vanilla Coke? No. Why is it orange? I mean, I like a vanilla Coke every once in a while, but... I don't know about this orange. That just sounds like too much. Too much in a can. I don't know if I can handle it. Six more. Five more. Basically orange cream coke. Well that, I don't know, that might be good. It just seems weird that coke is making an orange soda product. Something about that sounds wrong. But who am I to judge? Me and my friend have been playing Sekiro and Borderlands Remastered for over a week or two, then suddenly switched to Minecraft. Hmm. hmm. I don't know. I think I prefer the former to the latter, but I'm not going to judge you for your decisions. Minecraft is a good game, after all. Borderlands Remastered. I hadn't heard of that. Is it uh, original Borderlands Remastered, or is it Borderlands 2 Remastered? Because I love the Borderlands series. I wouldn't mind playing that. It's new, and it's supposed to taste like oranges and vanilla ice cream. Well, if it's new, I'm going to have to try this. Make a video review of it, post it on YouTube. <laughs> Just four minutes of me drinking a full can of... Orange, vanilla, coke. Oh. Almost there. One or two more kills. One or two more kills. We switch games a lot. Yeah, I do that too. Borderlands 1 Remastered, very cool. Yeah, I might have to check that out. They fixed a lot of the problems. Dude, I haven't played Borderlands 1 in so long. How's the graphics? Did they update them well, or is it just kind of like meh, like Dark Souls Remastered? I don't like Vanilla Coke. Not a big fan either, but every once in a while there'll be vanilla coke somewhere and I'm like, you know, that sounds good. I'll have one. But I rarely drink soda. I allow myself one soda a week on Friday nights and I always choose Baja Blast because it's the best. Alright! We finally got six skill points. Let's fucking get Shadow Rush and move on to bigger and better things. Oh, baby. Better be fucking good. 
Ugh, I'm gonna be lost in the dungeon forever, lol. Oh, you poor thing. What are you gonna do? Alright, let's get rid of all this cash. Buy whatever we can. Uh, divine confetti, sure. 234. May the dip I think that'll last a while. It looks good they also added more legendaries. Ooh, fun. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna have to look into this. We need to go to Ashina Castle, the dojo. Three Master was 4K, I think. Really? That's exciting. Go to the dungeon entrance, then turn around. <laughs> oh, lol. Gearbox manufactured. Alright. So. For combat art. We need Shadow Rush. For prosthetic... Probably just go for some direct damage with Phantom Kunai. Don't need that, just healing items. Alright, I think we're ready for our first attempt. Face me, Shinobi. Ow! Okay, so your bow is still a problem. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. I see why this is strong. Oh, all right. So I got to get that range down. And parrying would probably help. Oh my god, that's so good. Oh, he can't block it! This is incredible. <laughs> Fuck you, Genshiro. I have found your bane. Oh my god, this is so good. Oh dear. uses spirit emblems. Interesting. But I'm still able to cast the single version of it, even without spirit emblems. Interesting. Ah! Strategy, fam. Wonder if this works on Owl. Ah. 
Yeah. We just have phase three to deal with, essentially. I think the key here is lightning countering. It adds 500% melee damage if you get the lethal, lethal strike sucker punch on Mordecai. He becomes god. I got 99999 damage at level 27. Damn, good to know. If you add Bloodwig for range, it's beautiful. Interesting. You can get hid cooldown to one in a second, Mordecai. Can you use Tonto? What's Tonto again? You were victorious. Oh, the ceremonial Tonto? I, I probably could. Kinshiro is so or weird you. who brings a bow to a sword fight. Know. I know, right? What a fool. Shinobi of the Divine. Uh, 
Owl can Mercury counter. I know his Mercury counter is brutal. He fucks you up. Oh no, I don't know that I can get to Kuro to give him his rice. Oh, not so good. Fuck him up. Without first battling Owl. Hey, Emmy. This slam is everything. Get hell yeah. how he was able to resurrect. Wasn't the whole point of this, him trying to gain that power, so how did he get it? I don't know. I love how you fight the fucker three times just for him to commit suicide. I know, right? Psych, he comes back. Imagine killing Ludwig with Sekiro, Combat, or Koss. Oh. I honestly think I'd feel safer. The ability to deflect and parry in this game gives you, most of the time, a big feeling of comfort when you're good at it, which I'm not. But that would be fun. Well, guys, I think that's a good natural stopping point. We achieved our goal. We got Shadow Rush. It works on the boss super well, and we killed the boss. I'm happy with that. And we are going to pick up here. Uh, actually, on Monday, I think we're going to try and get back into Dark Souls 1. Because I've been neglecting the Lady Waifu over in Dark Souls 1 since Sekiro came out. And it's about time that we got back to it. So, if you would like to hang out with me on Monday, we're going to play Dark Souls 1. And uh, thank you all for being here. The Hunter versus Sekiro. Ooh, I want to watch that. Who wins, Nightwolf? Um, I'm going to say who would win in that fight. I mean, Sekiro has the huge advantage of being able to come back to life and stealth insta-kills. I'm going to have to think about it. I'm going to think about that. <laughs> I'll get back to you. All right, good night, everybody. Thank you for chilling. Love your faces. See you on Monday.